All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching Demon Slayer season three, episode six. Uh, in the last episode, we had Tanjiro unlocking his red sword in a way, uh, thanks to help from Nezuko making it an exploding blood demon art sword. Uh, whether or not I didn't, I don't actually think we got to see like the color of it post having it lit on fire in the episode. I can't remember, but maybe it will actually be a red sword from now. But we are still getting the new sword uh, with the new hill and the new blade as well so I don't know maybe the same thing can happen to that one or maybe I'm not sure I'm just speculating I don't know, I don't know what's gonna happen uh, but yeah Tanjiro dusted three of the uh, upper four clones and then the fourth one got dusted by Genya who is apparently some kind of half demon it would seem maybe it's something else but definitely points in that direction yeah very excited for this episode so as always guys if you're new to the channel please hit that subscribe button and like the video as well and let's go into this episode right now aren't you going to become a hashido hmm this is for real entertainment district right here everyone just gets fucking wrecked is he gonna be able to calm himself down oh does that hurt bitch does that hurt you gotta slash him up again. So how the fuck do we destroy them? Oh, his blade is red, I think. Bro, his blade looks sick. Where is the vile spot? A fifth demon? What? Where? <gasps> Bitch! Oh, he's still, he's still got a human side. Does he not, like, smell demon on him? <laughs> Anjo, you saw a happy person. <laughs> huh? <laughs> Bro. That face on Genya. Oh. Oh, no. Oh, oh, damn. He fucking dodged that. Good shit. This bitch fucking fixed himself already. Gun style. Let's go. <laughs> Look at her face. So Tanjiro's just not going to, like, talk about Genya. Kenya's appearance right now. Is it hiding in a bush? Oh, the original. So this is like, this is the brain. You kill the brain, they all die. This bad one's fucking annoying. Oh my god, this looks sick. Oh, shit, Nezgo. The impact. Come on, Nezgo. Oh, shit. Did he impale her again? Brother. Oh, back to this creepy fuck. Fuck him up, Takito. I mean, it'll be hard. But, you know, you can do it. Hopefully. Did he put her for a tree? Oh my god. Yo! What the fuck was that? Is that Tanjiro? Bitch, where did the fire come from? So he can just do that whenever he wants? Because, like, the, the I guess it's blood-stained? That's fucking sick. Oh, fucking... Oh, Nezuko looks badass. Oh! Bro, they are shaking in their boots right now. Oh! Oh, my God! My fucking ribs. The bullet popping kid. Didn't like, is it just Inosuke, Zenetsu, and um, Tanjiro that have like interesting senses? Or did this guy have one too? What? Oh! He's tiny! <laughs> yeah, shoot the little fucker. The way it's running away. <laughs> He's so Bakugo. Oh, get him! I'm sorry, what? 
Blast this little fucking mouse. I'm sorry, how do you beat this? Just fucking eat it or something. Oh my god. Tanjiro! There's a go! Oh. Oh shit, backstory time. Damn, so his brother's the... I want to say wind, Hashira? Yep, full on backstory time. <laughs> oh, he fucking hurt her. Damn. Deserved. I mean, he deserved to die. You have all these brothers and sisters. Oh. That doesn't sound like a child's voice. <laughs> Look at his little smile. It's about to be fucking tarnished. Am I about to watch this whole family be fucking killed? Oh shit, is this her? Has she been bitten? Bro, what is with this fucking anime and killing families of kids, man? It's a, it's his mom. This sucks. Even the little one in his arms? Oh my god. Well, him and Tanjiro got something in common. Oh, he had to kill his own mom. Fuck. Oh, she's burning up. Does he even know that it's a demon? Or does he just think his mom went crazy? That sucks. Or got that traumatizing backstory in this, like, split second. Seeing this, like, human side of Genya. So wait, has he become, like, a half-demon just because of that slash, then? It would make sense why he's not fully converted. She is so tiny. Damn. That's fucking sad, dude. Neither of them have scars on their face right now. Must have got them later. Oh, this is in the past. I thought this was, like, after that event. I'm ca I can't imagine this guy, as we know him now, as an adult, laughing like that. Is anybody gonna save this man? He's about to be impaled. Uh, yeah, I guess he did get that scar from his mom. That was just before that event. And that's why he wants to become a Hashiro? Damn. He wants to protect him. That's why he's saying that. I wasn't expecting to feel for this man right now. Oh, let's go, Tanjiro. I don't know, Tanjiro. It looks like you got the strongest sword technique right now. I think you should kill it. Genya joining the... Uh... Oh, fuck. Genya, Genya joining the squad? Dude. Blade looks so sick. What the fuck happened? Did he blast a hole in him? Oh my god! God damn, can you regenerate? Yeah. Tanjiro's gonna be, need to be the one to do it. That blood demon our sword's gonna help. That is insane. How fast can you regenerate? He's stopped bleeding, at least. Tanjo girls can also sniff the thing out as well. Again, you would struggle to find it now. The way it runs away, like fucking Jerry. Tom and Jerry, bro. Get his ass! Defeat this upper four, Tanjo. 
Let's go, please. No fucking way, did it? Bro! Right, so that was Demon Slayer Season 3, Episode 6. Very good episode. Genya's backstory is fucking heartbreaking. But what more can you expect from Demon Slayer other than wiping out entire families, including small children? Yeah, uh, I really like Genya as a character. I mean, I didn't have much reason not to like him originally. He was obviously just a Bakugo type, him being basically Bakugo. <laughs> um, but I'm, I'm, obviously, I don't mean to keep comparing it to the character just because of the voice actor and um, how he is. But yeah, he's a really cool character. I like him. It's cool that he's related to the, again, I believe, Wind Tashira. I think. Pretty sure. Um, so yeah, that's interesting. Um, and yeah, um, it's cool that he admitted to not being able to do it like to be able to slash him at this point he gave it to tanjiro like he's not you know headstrong like he understands it's the, the limits to his own power right now i also like how that he wants to become a hashira so he can actually see his brother again even though it's pretty much clear from my opinion that his brother didn't want him to join the demons demon slayer corpse because he he didn't you know he didn't want him to enlist he didn't want to put himself in danger um but yeah i guess I presume they're going to explain it at some point, why he's a part demon. I mean, we could, as an audience, could understand that it may just be from the slash that his mom gave him, but Tanjiro's not said anything about it. Maybe he won't, because he's still got, like, that human part of him. He's still in control. Maybe he just won't bring it up, because it doesn't need to. Maybe it's because he's, like, Nezuko. Um, but yeah, really good episode. Definitely looking forward to the next. Anyway, guys, I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Have a nice rest of your day, and peace out.